YouTube. Man, what's going on, y'all boys today, man? It's your boy CKS back with another video today. If you guys are new, be sure to like, subscribe, turn on notifications. And uh, yeah, if you don't see my title and thumbnail already, it's your boy's birthday. I ain't gonna lie. It's your boy's birthday today and I'm turning 19 on it. Yeah, I ain't gonna lie. I feel old. I don't know if y'all feel old. I feel old, bro. I ain't gonna lie. You know, it's crazy. Like, I don't know. Birthdays over the years, I've I've always been so hyped for them. Like, I'm, I'm hyped today. Don't, don't get me wrong. I'm just on some chill shit. You know, it's kind of it's kind of rainy outside. It was gloomy. But I'm on some cool little shit, man. But I ain't gonna lie. Um, yeah, it's your boy's birthday today. I ain't gonna do nothing too crazy. I do have work. It's not like, oh, why did you take off? Hey, it's payday. I <laughs> with that money. But, um, nah, the real party for my birthday, because it's going to be like a whole, this is going to be like the, the intro to like my birthday day in a sense. It's not going to be all captured in one day. Um, I'm going to have like this vlog go up for today, as in on this day, make sure I drop for my birthday, you know, since I have something to look back on. But the real party for my birthday, you know, the real hoorah kick, that's going to be in like another week. So y'all going to see it. Right. It's gonna be like another ten days. So another ten days on the 29th, that's when the real party gonna begin. So on the 29th, that's when y'all, I'm gonna just say it now. 29th, that's when the real birthday party, you know what I'm saying? Real a whole hoorah, everything we'll do. That's when it's gonna commence. So yeah, man, if you guys are new, make sure you like, subscribe, turn on notifications. Um and yeah, man, today I'm not gonna do too much. Just like I said, it's gonna be a little intro, a little cool chill vlog. So as you can see, I'm already dressed, got the HM on, got the fitted on the head. You know what I'm saying? H&M sweats on. Got them Lucky Green. Got them, um, right? Yeah, Lucky Green, Jordan one on the, on the toe. On some chill shit. And we ain't we that fast, ain't, man. We ain't, we ain't that GT on y'all last. But um, I'm going to just give y'all a little, a, little, a little chill, rainy POV drive. I got I to gotta shoot up somewhere. I ain't going to lie. I got to go to this little spot. And then, um, yeah, I may get some food. I don't know. I may get some food, low-key. But um, yeah, I'm going to show up to this little spot. Give y'all a little rainy day POV. But first, before we even get there, I gotta give y'all the cold start, bro. I know y'all I know y'all love hearing the exhaust. So I'm give y'all a little cold start. We'll see how it goes right here real quick. No cap. Oh. Little worm on the head though. What's poppy gang? But let me get a little a little a little a little what got down. Um, what's got down. Um, But yeah, that's what we're gonna do. And um, I'm gonna hop on the road. I just wanna give y'all a little pop real quick. I don't think I never heard the car. Got down. Um, a little over on the air. Damn, look at that. But uh, yeah, man. In that fast thing, we'll get on the road. Um, probably grab a little bit of food. <laughs> but no, yeah, man. This will be a little chill. A little chill vlog. I know y'all know would be like more hype. Like, oh, why you not hyping your birthday? Woo. I work. <laughs> so I'm just on some chill shit. But I'm definitely going to give y'all a little POV drive. Because you can see it's rainy as hell outside. So. See the basketball room? I used, to, I used to be Jordan back in the day before I, before I you know, took it seriously and worked. So, you know what I'm saying? Y'all want to look. All right, yeah, no, I'm quick call that shit out. But I'm up on the road, y'all, and uh, get a little POV drive, and I may go get some food. But uh, y'all see in a couple seconds. Yeah. Type B. All right, y'all, but I'm back. I ain't gonna lie. Did a little bit of drive, but we are back. We are on the way to the little shebang. Get what we need to get. Um, oh yeah, man, I ain't gonna lie. Like, today's a chill day. Like, I don't know. To me, when it rains, it kind of brings my mood down, but I also do like the aesthetic of rain and the sense of just like what the city looks like or just what the world looks like when it's underwater in a weird sense. I don't know, it looks, it looks, it looks cool and calm, but you know what I mean? Like, the, you know, the detail in the clouds. Like, right now, it's gray hour. That's kind of how I look at it. 
You know what I mean? So I don't look at it as like, but my phone, my car, close to my face, I'm an idiot. Um, I don't look at it as like it's irritating or I'm mad or I'm sad because it's rainy. No, it's a little gloomy, but it's gray out. You know, it's just like, you know what I mean? So that's life. That's how, you know, the world is. Ooh, still looks pretty in a sense. If you guys like at least acknowledging the world that you live in and follow the detail, color and everything like that. Um, but, oh yeah, man. You're out here driving out the belt, as you can see. Goddamn. How y'all day going though, man? At least where y'all stay at. Is it like rainy out there where y'all is? Is it sunny? I know it is getting towards the end of the year, so fall is upon us now. It's no more hot sunny day. We'll pop out in some shorts and, um, and a t shirt and kind of enjoy ourselves. But, you know, we're making the most of what we can do. You know what I mean? It's all we really can do, you know? Um, yeah, yeah, man. I think I've never really seen the Forte, Forte in daytime, bro. But type B. Look pretty hard. I'm a smart boy right now, I can't lie to you. I'm a smart like a mug, I can't lie to you. Man, I can't wait till I get this front strut, this, this front sway bar, wherever the hell it is, to reduce the wheel hop in the front. Because I ain't gonna lie with this car, bro. Especially in daytime. Not daytime, but. Excuse me. And um, when it's raining, bro, this thing, when it's raining, dude, it, it spins, bro. It really does spin. That's if you like get on it a little bit. If you like dang their coast, it won't really do too much. It won't really do too much, but bro, just the, the pain of it spinning the way it does. Kind of irritating, I can't lie to you. Like I can show y'all. He turns lights off on the online. That's the uh, daytimes. But no, it's cool. I like, I like, I like whooping this thing. outside though I'll be forgetting it's like seven gears in this thing dude I can't lie I'll be forgetting like I'll be forgetting bro because the cruise had a what was it the cruise had a the cruise at six so every time I drive and I'm like Ain't it done? Nope, I need one more gear. I'll put the gear one more time. But nah, I still I do like the paddles in this paddle space. Plus and the minus. I'm gonna do a video, I'm gonna do a video for y'all on like how to really use them. Cause some people they may not know what's the deepest gear or, or uh, how deep you may need to use these. Or when to like upshift. Woo woo. I feel like if you're a real car head, you'll know just by simply um the sound of the engine you know if it's roaring if, you, if you're used to your car at least you'll know like oh if the engine's roaring to if this engine's roaring really loud i think i need a shift because no point to be sitting here stuck in the fourth gear and your rpms is too dang deep you're gonna dang near blow up the car so but no i'm, I'm, I'm gonna make a video for y'all if you guys don't know how to use paddle shifters at least people that don't got them and would like to know how they work i got y'all I'm, I'm, I'm gonna get y'all right man just just wait on me you know what i mean i did take a little break from youtube i was working getting my life together handling a bunch of things you know what I'm saying, but I'm a, uh, I'm gonna get right for y'all. Just, just give me, just give me a little, a little bit of time. That's all I ask. You know what I mean? Staying along, staying with me along this journey. You know, being consistent, working and things, like things of that nature. And dogs don't get over. Look at little Mexican, do a little parade. This joint get up, bro. No cap. This joint move. Let's go. Sunroof. Oh, no hands on the head, dumbass. <laughs> but, nah. This thing does move nicely, and I actually like how this thing drives. Really, you know, satisfied with this as a whole. Some people may have like backlash, like, oh, it used to be how they, uh, Fortes. Fortes weren't, you know, as good as they used to be back in the day, but you gotta understand all the tech that they, at least with certain ones, they stuffed through a bunch of tech, refreshed everything, changed everything. This kind of just has to be to your liking, um, if you like it or not. And also about that ding dang, uh, I put, I put in a sport for y'all. So I see. Uh, we, we was in smart. I put in a sport for y'all. See, y'all can see what I meant about, um, about the line. I'm pretty sure when I hit it, 
when I hit it, this joint's gonna spin like crazy, bro. And it does like rip. Like, I, like if, it, if it was daytime, different story. But I'm not daytime, idiot. Um, dry conditions, like sunny, you know, hot as hell, broad daylight. Yeah, but this is rainy conditions, bro. The tire. What the fuck he doing? Bro, over here playing in the day. I don't know what his ass on, but causing that damn jam. damn their whole burnout so no yeah um, driving the speed limit be safe don't do that reckless stuff harm people's lives people could die don't do it no mm -mm. you got speed limit speed limit only no cap but yeah it just spins too much is why i don't get on it mm -mm. i don't get on it i just be on some chill i just be on some chillness yeah, I ain't gonna lie to it, but we got a little ch chill pill be the rain kinda stopped now. I can turn these off. But yeah man. This is the forte, you know what I mean? The one of one soon to be. Um I gotta gotta get some more damn fences fell down, but I gotta get some more money to, you know, mod everything that I wanna do. Cause bro, car parts, you guys don't know, it ain't cheap. <laughs> I'm telling you, I'm gonna tell you this first. If you ever wanted to um if you ever wanted to mod a car, okay. Um, if you ever wanted to mod a car, woo, woo, you always thought about it. I'm gonna tell you first, the mods are not cheap. <laughs> At least I'm tired, bro. I'm not gonna lie. I've been exhausted. If, if I keep yawning, don't don't horse me in the comments. I'm sorry, but um, car parts are not cheap, bro. Especially what you want to do, and if you want it to be quality in a sense of what your standards of what your liking may be. It's not cheap like, at all. I'm not gonna lie. Um, no. They're not cheap, bro. Like, if you want a good set of rims, probably run you a smooth K, 1200, 1300. And that's depending on what you do. You can get some cheap rims. It's not like rims or arm and a lip. I thought I hung up. I, mean, I thought I had it to be dead. The animal carcass was everywhere. RIP. But, um, but no. Uh, rims, you can get cheap rims. But it depends if you're liking, you know, the rims that I like. I always want my rims to show. But I gotta comp with the with the standard stock rims that come on this car. I gotta get some rims that either complement the car more or brings out detail in the car. Whether it's whatever that the car will have. If you will have if you have like a bright car, you wanna have chrome or white rims or black rims or bronze. They have that as well or like um, or brass on the cover. Uh, brass they may call it, depending on whatever you're liking may be. Um, you will kind of see if you really like it, you know what I mean? I've seen, I've, like, I don't discriminate, I don't be the one to judge what they do. Ooh, ooh. You like it, I love it. Would I do it? No. That is just clear as day. If would I do it with something that you do and I don't like it, no. That's, that's you though. Know. All right, you know what I'm saying? You, 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 you do you, but I'm not going to be the one to, I'm going to let him go in front of me. His ass over here. Go ahead, champ. Um, would I do something like that? Not really. And is it bad? No, but it's just something that I would, um, that I personally wouldn't do, you know what I mean? But, you know what I'm saying? Life is like people, people's, um, likes are, you know, their likes for a reason. It's not my point to judge because they did it for a reason, you know what I mean? They got it, they know it's gonna be, they're gonna get some feedback whether they care or not. At the end of the day, I don't care. Whatever I do, it's because I love it. You know what I'm saying? You little haters out there that be watching me and be despising me what I'm doing. If you don't like what I'm doing, Go get you something and make it way better if you're really mad about it. But at the end of the day, I don't know you. You don't know me. I don't know you about your true intentions. Woo woo. Like, I honestly care less about what you do because this is my life. You know what I mean? You're not living in my head. You're not thinking for me. You're not doing whatever I want to do. You're not doing nothing for me. You know what I mean? You're your own person. And that's what's going to be till you're here no more. You know what I'm saying? So don't, wherever, wherever the hell out there making you feel like, feel like you less than who you are as a human being, just because you're doing something that you like. Forget them, man. Tell them to go do it. You know what I'm saying? Go play in the street or something. Because at the end of the day, who are you to tell me who I am as a person and what I can and can't do? You know what I mean? So, whoever out there hating on you, tell them, fuck the haters. Whatever they said, man. Fuck the haters. Tell them to go kick rocks. You know what I mean? 
asshole. Mm -mm. Time to get on and go go do something with their life, man. Cause it's my life. You know what I mean? So people may hate on me. Oh, why would you get this? Why did you get that? Why did you get this out of third? You got one? <laughs> Where is that? You know what I mean? Shit. Oh, I should have got a wide body scat or a wide body Hellcat or something like that. Where a Hellcat? Where a Traco? Where a Lambo? Goddamn. Where a McLaren? Where a Bugatti or something? You know what I mean? Where a Koenigsegg? If you ain't go. If you ain't got it, then why are you trying to criticize what I'm doing? How about you go get you something? They can talk to me. Even at that, I still don't care. <laughs> like I don't care, bro. You know what I mean? People always got something to say. Either they gonna they gonna they got something to say if you working. They got something to say if you're not working. So I could have been doing nothing, bro. I could have been doing nothing, just kicking rocks, enjoying life, living day to day, just in the crib all day. Oh, you a bum? Ooh, you ain't doing nothing to yourself. All right, take my butt to work. Ah, right, ooh, all you do is work. You don't want to come kick. It. Okay. You do this, do this, do this, do that. All right. So, <laughs> you got a problem with it? Why you care so much? You know what I mean? Don't worry about what the next man is doing. Live your life, bro. Live your life. Don't worry about what the next man is doing. Because at the end of the day, you came in this mug alone, you're going to lead this mug alone. That's just the hard, hard cold truth, bro. You came in this world alone, you're going to lead this world alone. You're going to enjoy this time for while you got. We don't know. We don't know what day God has wrote us. Shit, for all I know, I can go tomorrow. I don't want to, but live your day and live your life day by day to the most you can because you never know what will happen tomorrow. You know what I mean? Tomorrow's never promised. Yeah, we may have plans and dreams and aspirations like I just told y'all in the beginning part of the video. Oh, we got something we're going to do in 10 days. Man, life could work its magic and something could happen before them 10 days. You know what I mean? Just being real with y'all. Not saying I would like for that to happen, but I'm just being honest to God truth. I'm being real. Yeah, I'm looking forward to something in 10 days, but in 10 days, something can happen. You know what I mean? Not saying I would like that for that to happen, but, you know, life is just doing its do. Doing its do. You know what I'm saying? So, nothing's promised, bro. You know what I mean? If you got some bread and you want to go buy something, yeah, you know what your ultimate goal is. Be smart to money. Don't, don't, don't be a little idiot. Don't go blowing all of it because you got it. No, be smart. But if you want something, bro, really bad, and you can make it back, Go get it, bro. Who am I to be like, now you can't, can't get this woo because you ain't got enough funds or whatever the hell, or um, you want a time limit. You want something like, go get it, bro, because shit, you never know, man. I ain't gonna lie. Like, I don't know. I'm probably talking y'all heads off, but I'm just talking that talk. You know what I mean? Like, I'm, I'm a great listener. For who I am as a human being and my great traits, I can listen a lot, bro. Like, you know what I mean? I can sit here and listen to you going through things you're going through like especially when i don't want to talk to talk to me you know what i mean y'all may you may not know me you may not trust me with all the um sense of things going on in your life but hey man if you need someone to talk to you know what i mean always shoot me a little text or a dm uh, you can comment on one of the videos if you feel comfortable with, with the being out there it's not like it's out of the world but you know if you're comfortable com comfortable we'll speak out what you're going through in your life i'm a great listener hey man just lay it off your chest because People these days, man, I don't always have someone to talk to about the things that they're going through. You know, you know what I'm saying? Mental health is a real thing. I don't get, I don't, I don't get all sad on y'all. You know what I mean? I'm just talking that talk, though. Like, you know, mental health is a real thing. You know, people are really going through things. And if you, if you really need help, bro, reach out. You know what I'm saying? It's not it's not, it's not, not bad to tell somebody the things you're going through or um, about how you're feeling. Because me, as who I am as a human being, I would love someone to talk to. You know what I mean? I got people in my corner, but it's just certain things that you talk to. Some, ugh, it's certain things to talk to people about, and there's certain things you don't. And, and some things I just don't talk to people about. You know what I mean? I just keep it built up. Don't let it, you know, uh, don't let it take over your body. And don't let it make you do things that you will regret doing later on in life. Because, bro, you have a whole life. You were brought here on this planet, on this world to live and enjoy yourself, you know what I mean? Make sure you do that Talk about by any means, you know what I mean? Don't be with someone that make you feel less of yourself. Don't hang around certain people if they're not motivating you to be better. At the end of the day, people come and go, you can't be mad or sad about things that happen, you know what I mean? Yes, they happen, but they happen for a reason. And it's all within God's plan and it happens for a reason, you know what I mean? Like, people come in my life and I can name off a handful. People came in my life and do I talk to them to this day? No. Do I have bad blood with them? No. I still cool all those people. It's just we just don't conversate like that no more. I mean, it is what it is. You know what I mean? People surround themselves, surround themselves with their own group of people, their own group of friends. You know what I mean? It's people that they gravitate towards. You know what I mean? You have that um, piece of time to enjoy that person's presence as long as they're here with you. 
you know what I mean? So, hey man, people come and go. Make sure you enjoy seeing what you see. Um, if you enjoy it, make sure to hold it daily close to you, but also put yourself first before all these people, bro. I ain't gonna lie, that's the one thing people get messed up in this world. People don't put this up before other people and they become dependent on others and the others is just a function. I mean, hey, I ain't gonna lie, I've messed up on that part once. Well, I messed up once in my life with that, not once, but multiple times where I've um, put others before me. Yes, you would love someone to be around and talk to because I ain't gonna lie, it, it, it'd be cool thugging it out, but thugging it out, bro, it, it does. It, start, it, starts to, it starts to sit with you, you know what I mean? Like you start, you know, you start seeing the world differently for what it really is. Because I ain't gonna lie, being my birthday, not saying people are obligated to tell me it. No, I mean, people, they remember, they remember. But I mean, if you really rocking me, you'd have been like some, oh shit, you know what I'm saying? It, it, okay, you know what I'm saying? Like, bro. Let's be realistic. In a full 24 hour span, bro, you could have just said, you could have took like one minute, a minute and 30 seconds out of all 24, just to, just to shoot a tweet text, be like, happy birthday, man. All right, go. Just say that. Happy birthday, go do whatever you want to do. Cause shoot, if I'm who I am to reach out and tell someone happy birthday, just because out of the spite, like, you know what I'm saying? People may not have someone to talk to, they may not have their parents or a favorite sibling to tell them happy birthday every single year. You know what I mean? Just to be there. You know what I mean? Like, just someone to be there. Like, despite all the shit I be going through, all the things I be going through, bro, I always try to make time just for the people to actually be there for me. Despite whether they've been there for me when I was going through it, be there for me when I was, when I didn't have nothing. You know what I mean? Be there for me now while I'm trying to and while I have some of these things. Yeah, I'm yawning again. I'm tired, bro. But being there when I finally got these things, I still, you know, try to make sure people, you know, know that they're appreciated because... They, some people out there may not feel like they're being appreciated, you know what I mean? And that's just the way our life is, you know? Um, I'm probably talking our heads off, though, but I ain't trying to make it all sad and gloomy, but I'm just talking, I talk, man. Like, you honest to God, just listen to what I'm saying. I'm not trying to just ramble just to talk, you know what I mean? I'm not just chatting just to chat. I'm honestly speaking just to people that actually have, um, that actually feel the way I feel or may feel like they're alone and may not have no one to talk to. You're not alone, you know what I mean? There's always someone to call. I got a number you can call. You know, I mean, Logic. If you ever listen to the rapper Logic or the artist, uh, Bobby Tarantino, Young Sinatra, you know, he's a song 1 800 called a hotline. You know, it's like, get the help you need because shit, I should have done it. You know, I didn't, but here I am to tell the tale. And I'm okay. So, you know what I mean? Together, you ever feel down in life, man? There's always something we can talk to. But damn, there's always something we can talk to, man. You're not alone in this, man. For sure. I ain't gonna lie to you. But, Besides all that, um, besides all that little rah rah that was speaking, how y'all feeling, man? Well, we burst into the left, all right, man. But other than that, we gonna, we gonna switch the vibe on y'all last. How y'all feeling today, man? Y'all feeling great, you know what I mean? It's sunny out, I mean, it's cloudy out. As you can see, bam, on the air, uh, it's sunny out, but you know, we still making do what we got. No keys to keep out. You know what I'm saying, man? Yeah, man. Got that 160 on the goddamn dash on the end. We only going 45. That's the speed limit. No cap. Um, but not yet, man. You know, be grateful for what you got. Don't hold nothing higher above than yourself. You know what I mean? So, for me, for example, not to idolize the cars every day. Jesus, I'm tired. Whew. I'm sorry. I'm sorry for yawning. I'm sorry. I, I'm a human being. I need sleep. <laughs> But we grinding, you know what I mean? God don't stop to the cast drop, you know what I'm saying? But God tells you, don't idolize something higher than what it really is, you know what I mean? And, 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 and that's how I reworded it. So for me, don't idolize this car. It's everything in the world. Like, oh my God, this this car creates me. I'm me because of this. No, I was me before I had this. I was me while I had this and until I keep it on, mod it, do everything I want to do to it until I sell it or get rid of it later on in life. Later on, years down the road. You know what I mean? And not right now. You have to come out. Can't, can't, can't do it right now, champ. But, you know what I mean? Just grateful to have this. You know what I mean? Very grateful to have this and be able to experience owning this. You know what I mean? Because there's people out there that don't got a car. And I ain't gonna lie. Um, I'm one of those people, you know, at a point in time. It's not hard, but it definitely ain't easy. You know what I mean? Your first step to achieving a vehicle, there's cheap ones out there for a couple hundred. Get you a little wooty. I'm, 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 I'm gonna give y'all some game. All right, bro. Look, let's be realistic. You're in my age bracket. 
You gain or may not have no bills. The only bill you may really have is your phone bill. Phone bill, you got, okay. You have to honestly realize what is the difference between wants and needs, you know what I mean? You gotta realize, do I want this or do I need this? Is this mandatory or is this just because I see it and it look pretty? Y'all see his ass? Fuck no, I caught back there. <laughs> I look, I'm like, <laughs> no cap. He's he chilling. He ain't popped out right now. Look at that. <laughs> but um, you have to really understand the the difference between a want and a need. You know what I mean? You gotta understand what's really what's really needed at this point in time, and what's not. You know what I'm saying? This car right now, did I really need to get it? No. It was a want. I, me, for who I am, I wanted this. You know what I'm saying? It's something that I wanted, a new little toy. It just sent me back. But I get it by any means. You know what I'm saying? I'm a hard worker. It's just, it's just a little gift for myself. Um, people may not see that for that. People are like, oh, you just, you dig around. Like, you dig around. You on my dick for what? I don't even know you. Get your ass on. Go go live your life, bro. Don't talk to me. Don't, don't try to hate on me. Cause I got this. If you mad, Go get something better than me, bro. I don't care. Words, words, words who? Like, I swear to God, I don't care, bro. If you hating on me because of what I got, could be the weirdo, could be the lame man, and go get something to life, bro. Oh, that. Damn. Stupid. Could be the weirdo, bro. Go do something with your life, man. Worrying about the other man because you, you mad because you got something. What you got? You got something more than me? Congratulations. I'm proud of you. You know what I'm saying? If somebody tell you they're proud of you, I'm proud of you. You hating on me? I don't care. Go kick rocks. Go play in the field. Go, go play over there. Damn, go play in the street. You know what I'm saying? Go do something with your life, bro. Because people are weird these days, bro. Surround yourself by people that motivate you to be better. And I promise you, that is the word of the day. Or phrase, whatever you want to call it. Surround yourself by people that want you to be better. Because if you, if you surround yourself by people that make you feel less than yourself, you ain't going get nowhere in life, bro. You're not going to be motivated to keep going grinding. Cause I tell you, bro. If you know me, if you know me who I was when I was working with, when I had my crews, bro. All I did was work. I'm telling you. Did I have to? No. Did I want to? Yeah, no cap, I did. Like, when I had the cruise, let's be realistic, it was an LS Chevy Cruise. Did I really have to sit here and go to work every single day, day in and day out, closing 42s, 45s, doubles, 12 hour shifts, 15 hour shifts, 16 hour shifts? Did I really have to do that? Hell no. Did I choose to do that shit? Hell yeah, no cap. Yes, yeah, that. I, like, bro. I love money. I'm a I'm a chill guy. As you can see, I don't really wear no flashy stuff. You see the fit? Black on black with a white tee, or it's a cream t-shirt. You, you'll see I'll take the video. It's a cream t-shirt. It's pretty cool. You know what I'm saying? Jordans. I ain't really getting into shoes like that until um like a year ago. April shit. Red line, yeah. Nah, I don't want to crash. I'm using my paddles. Take this up video. I, I, I'll get y'all right how to use these paddles. But, um, I only get into shoes until like a year ago, bro. And I sit here and be like, some dark we need shoes. I really need the, the latest drops. I really need like Rick ones or anything like that. No, it's just a one. Do I buy any of it? No. Woo! Excuse me. Do I buy any of that stuff? Nah, I ain't gonna lie. When I was working at Cans, bro, I, I worked. I worked. At a, I worked at a fast food spot. That's how. I, that's how I really stack my bread. I mean, is it really anything wrong working a nine to five or working a part time job? No, there's nothing wrong with it. That's a blessing. You can. You can. You can work and give you some money in your pocket, bro. That's a blessing. You know what I mean? I used to work a job where I was getting paid stupidly under minimum wage, bro. Like, bro, I was making like nine fifty. If you know how much things cost in this day and age, you think you're gonna survive off nine fifty an hour? And you're only getting like 15, 12, 15 hours a week. Do the math, bro. 13, 14 hours, nine and a half, and taxes hit you, right? <laughs> then you got pay insurance, pay your phone bill. I really didn't have nothing left in my pocket. I kind of only had enough money to, to fill up my tank, and that was for that same exact week. Maybe fill like half the tank. You know what I mean? You got to kind of really get your life in order, bro. Because, bro, I could really go to college, but do I really want to go to college? Nah, I don't. I would love to. I always see the college life, and I love it. 
my love is in my heart for it. it irks to be in school and go you know go to a different spot go to a different place bro because especially if you live in somewhere where you don't we don't like bro get out I'm telling you get out there's nothing wrong with leaving where you're from bro it's not like you have to prove anything to where you're at let's be realistic bro a whole 20 25 years ago you was never here or i thought so where you're at don't think you're you're, you're, you're um don't think you're, you're set to be stuck where you are bro there's always room to branch out it's always room to expand your life and go live bro you only got one shot at this bro at least you would want to go go explore and go see where the different landscapes out there go see what the world truly is bro oh my god i'm sorry i'm sorry for yawning bro i'm just i'm really tired but you should honestly live your life bro by any means don't try to take someone out because you're you're envious of what they got bro if you're really envious bro use that shit as motivation all i speak on is motivation i'm not sitting there being no douchebag and just taunting and flaunting about what i got no at the end of the day so anything you got in this world bro can be gone in a, in a blink of an eye like just like that i can mess around fire for road crash everything on damn you know what i mean like it is what it is bro it's kind of just got to vibe out enjoy your life bro for sure but hopefully y'all didn't really um despise me just ranting I kind of, I don't really got no one to talk to like that on some shit. Me being real. Like, I got some people, but just for me, who I am, I'm a thinker. I just be in my head a lot. So, to really sit here and break down everything I got going on in my head, I don't got, I don't really want to talk about all the shit I got going on. I feel like I just makes another person depressed. So, I ain't gonna, I ain't gonna use that word, and maybe a trigger word. For me, it is. Um, but it may make you sad. You know what I mean? So, just know. You're not alone in this world, bro. There's people out there that's going through the same things you're going through. Maybe even worse. I pray that it gets better for all y'all, man. But for sure, bro. Hope you, hope you guys did enjoy this little uh, this little sit down talk, riding with me type thing. This this is just the first part of my birthday. Um, what's it called? This is like a little first part of my birth my birthday vlog. I kind of want to give y'all like just some little motivation talk, a little talk with y'all. Just let y'all know y'all not alone. Whatever you feeling like you're going through, there's people going up, going through the same thing you're going through. Just always help. You know what I'm saying? Seek help if you need it, because it's not it's not bad to ask for help. It is always a blessing to ask that and be able to have the opportunity to do so. So, um, yeah, man. Uh, yeah. Just know if you guys supporting me, if you guys made it to the end of this video, man. Drop a drop a. Uh, Drop a three. If you made if you made it to the end of this video, just drop, drop drop like a number three in the comments, man. If you made it to the end of the video, just to see to watch this whole thing through, man. You know what I mean? But yeah, man. Uh, I'm here for y'all for sure. If you're here for me, you rock with me. Come on, keep kicking, man. But uh, yeah, make sure you guys like, subscribe, turn on post notifications. Um, this is just the first part of my birthday vlog. It was nothing too crazy, like I have said already. Um, the real party gonna begin in about a week. Uh, yeah, man. I got so many things planned for y'all. All I ask y'all just kind of ride with me along on this journey. Taking it step by step and stones, man. Taking it by step by step. We gonna make it, bro. All, all my dogs out there that, that that feel like they ain't they ain't got the motivation to make it, bro. Coming from me, you gonna make it, bro. Just stay on your grind, bro. Get what you're trying to get to, bro. You have a goal. Set your goal and put out, lay out steps on how about how you want to achieve it. Shit. shit. Shit can be achieved by any 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 means possible. ASP, you know what I'm saying? Any means possible, bro. Anything you want can be achieved in life, bro. Just get that hard work and go get it, bro. Where to? But that's all for me. I'm done. Talk y'all heads off, bro. Hope y'all use this thing. Use my use my words of motivation as motivation. And uh, yeah, man, I love y'all. I'm gonna see y'all in the next video. Peace out. I'm gonna give you. I'm gonna give y'all a little pull though. Where to? Where to? You know what I'm saying?